Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, let's code from DNA to mRNA to transfer RNA to the amino acid, and we'll try to keep it in simple terms. DNA is made up of four nitrogen bases, adenine, cytosine, guanine, and thymine. Let's shorten this to A, C, G, and T. A will always pair with T, and G pairs with C. So if you have this strand of DNA and it is moving from 5' prime to 3', prime, then the complementary strand you will have A will pair with T, G with C, and you can watch the rest. The template strand is moving from 3' prime to 5'. Prime. What's this about 3' prime and 5'? Prime? In very simple terms, the phosphate group is attached to the 5 carbon of the sugar ring. This is why it's called the 5' prime end. The hydroxyl group is attached to the 3 carbon of the sugar ring, which is why it's called the 3' prime end. Now, the messenger RNA is similar to DNA, but it's also very different. Instead of the nitrogen-based thymine, you have uracil. So now, with this complementary strand of the DNA that has unzipped, you are left with this strand of DNA, which is used as a template for the mRNA. The T will pair with an A, and the A with the U, C with G, and so forth. I will circle the pairings of the U's and the A's just for emphasis. This step is part of transcription. Now, transfer RNA pairs with messenger RNA, and messenger RNA will be the codon and the transport RNA will be the anticodon. The transfer RNA has uracil, therefore A will pair with U, and U will pair with A, G with C, and then so forth. This takes place outside the nucleus and is part of translation. Now let's find the amino acid which is attached to the tRNA. You can use an amino acid chart. I'm using an mRNA chart, so I will use the messenger RNA codon, and the mRNA will code in triplets. Notice you are reading from 5' prime to 3'. Prime. AUG, going A to U to G, pairs up with methionine. Next, I have CCU, and it pairs up with proline. C U A pairs up with leucine, and G U A pairs up with valine. So there's the completed project from DNA to mRNA to tRNA to the amino acid attached to the tRNA. I hope that helps in coding these. Thanks for watching, and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please.